Hello everybody and welcome back to Rat Tales. If you already saw by the title, I have officially 10 rats. And today I'm going to be explaining how I have 10 rats. Right, so let's start off this story by I earned money because I got a job and I earned about $200. So then that spurred my idea, what if I got another pet? Then I did lots and lots of research on rats and different animals and I came up with the answer as rats. So I never had a pet rat before. and about a few months ago. I never had a rat, rat. So before I even attempted to ask my parents, I did tons and tons of research. I did four pages worth. I typed it out in a Google Doc thing so I could have it. And then I finally asked my parents. And my mom was like, uh, but she was like, okay. And then I started showing her these cute little videos of them. And I showed her all the research I did. My dad also was like, uh, and then they were like, oh, okay, all right. So then they finally agreed to let me get a rat. So about a week later, I came up a cage and it was $75 and I ended up buying it and I went and got it and did all that. So then came the day that I found a ad online and it was for three rats and now it's yours. And they looked really, really cute, and they melted my heart. <laughs> got them around September. We texted the lady, and she said we could get them the next day. So we went down, and we went and got them, and we brought them home. And then we put them in my feisty ferret cage, which was the cage that costed $75. And we put them in there, and let me remind you, they are four months old. One inch bar spacing. They went right through the bars. <laughs> so we had to wire all the cage, which sucked. So we had to put them back in the traveling cage that they came home in, and it took us an hour or two to put the mesh on. And my grandma was there to help us because she wanted to see the rats. She came at just the right time and she helped us. And then they were a little skittish at first, but they ended up getting a little bit more used to it. And they ended up, that night, they ended up sleeping up in a basket. And this is what it looks like, this stuff. Uh, that, and that's why I have wire in my cage, if you guys were ever wondering why I had wire in the cage, that's, that's the reason why. Then about six days later, in the morning, I went to check on them. And I looked in the basket, I heard um, squeaking. And I was like, what is that? Because there was only three in the cage. I looked up in their basket because I wanted to check in on them. And they had babies. Sunny had babies. My mind was blown. Now, before this, we were kind of, we saw the belly and we weren't quite sure. We were like, no, no, psh, babies. My mom, my mom almost fell over. It was just, and we were new at this, so it was just, yeah, we were like, oh my goodness. And then about three days later on actually September 11th, which was 9-11, Luna, she had babies. <sighs> my dad already had a heart attack. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But my parents were like, they were not, they were not very happy, but they were okay with it. A month or two later, I, we put them up for adoption, which is a very sad day. Um, my, at first my dad let me pick out, sorry the lighting changed, um, it got dark outside, so gotta compensate for that. But anyways, I got to choose two rats, and the rats I chose was Misty and Pepper. Sunny and Luna's babies, and we had, which was 19 in total, which is crazy and minus two plus my babies um and then we put them all up for adoption which was which was really really sad <laughs> then we ended up finding homes for almost all the boys except one because we fell in love with him 
and we were trying to sell them as pairs, but there was one, this little man right here, but um, we, um, we fell in love with him, so we decided to keep him, and we are getting him neutered in about a month or so, and I personally am really against neutering, but my whole family fell in love with him. So after we got every, almost, almost everybody uh, adopted, we had four girls, and then my girls that I chose. So we had, we had six in total that we, that we had. It was on Christmas Eve that, um, cause we've been finding, trying to find them homes for a long time cause boys are better selling than girls, which is very unfair, but I don't know why it's like that. Christmas Eve, we, my dad finally said that I could keep four of the babies. Now I was very, very, very grateful of this and he told me why. The reason being is because I'm homeschooled, I have a lot of time on my hands, and I'm very responsible because I clean the cage once a week, and I spend lots and lots of time with them. I do free ranging with them, I do training with them, I do lots of stuff with them. He said that's the reason why, kind of the reason why, and I just, he said that I just take really good care of them. So, so that's basically my story. Um, now I have 10 and I'm going to be getting this little guy neutered and I don't know if you've seen in my past videos, I attached him to the cage right here so he's not very lonely. I know they're not supposed to be alone whatsoever. We're trying our best. We cannot get another rat because I have 10 and we were keeping him really, really busy. I get him out for like an hour or two a day and he just hangs out on my shoulder and yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed that story time um it was kind of a long one but hopefully I hit all the key points I think I should have if, if not then I probably corrected it as I was editing but so I hope you guys enjoyed that little per se story of how I got my rats originally and if you guys have any questions about this story time leave it down in the comments and if you also if you guys have any names for my new pet rats leave it down in the comments and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!